So we just made it to our room in Cartagena. Zoom out. Zoom out. Cartagena. Cartagena. We just made it to our room in Cartagena. And um, we've been, we were here for one day? One night already. Yeah. One night already in this hotel. Um, the room we chose was a little bit not private and a little small so we upgraded to this room so i thought i'd show you before we destroy it and make it dirty <laughs> so um <laughs> so when you walk in you have like this closet lots of closet space with like five hangers <laughs> <laughs> julian and we have this big bed and I like the headboard with the lights, pretty cool. Um, pretty simple, TV, balcony, so desk, a little bit of a seating area. I like that we have a window here and we're just higher up so we can see more out. Um, we can see the ocean is right there. And this is the view from the balcony. You can see the pool. Nice little walking pool area. It's water and you could like chill in the water. And I think we were over there. So literally I could see right across. Someone could see into my room and I could see people eating. And so I just like that this is a, a little bit more private. So, Clark to Hannah. This is the fire escape. Okay. That's how you get out. If there's a fire, you just use a ladder, throw it down, and then you just hop on. Ride it like a bird. Ride it. <laughs> <laughs> so. Um, yeah, I, I like it here a lot more than Bot Bodega, Bodega, Bogota, Bogota. Sorry, I always okay. mix up the, I always mix up those words. The wow. You were saying Bogota. Yeah, <laughs> Bogota. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, I think right. <laughs> but I like here more than Bogota because. It's like way warmer here. It's like 80 degrees. It's very hot. Like, geez, you feel like you're in the Caribbean because we're next to the Caribbean Ocean. Sea. <laughs> sea. sea. No, the Caribbean Sea. Oh, Caribbean Sea. Oh, are you saying yes? Um, ocean Sea. The Caribbean Sea. And um, it's really hot here, but in Bodega, it was very cold. It felt like San Francisco. And also, there's a lot of tropics here. It's very green, so I really enjoyed that. This is like the vibe I wanted out of the trip, um, to enjoy heat, swimming, tropical energy, not, you know, being in a cold city, because I get enough of that during my normal life. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to show you what we're up to. This is our first full day. Got yeah, it. awesome. It's locked and loaded. <laughs> they don't, they're like, why do you need, to? I'll show you the bathroom. It is, hello, Echo. Why? No, oh, you need the key card to turn on electricity. That's Let the there part. be light. <laughs> okay, well, can you see in the dark? Can I do a night shot? Oh, this function is currently not available. It's coming. Why, why is it not available? Before. The lights turned on? Well, you get the point. We got a sink, mirror, toilets, and a shower. So, pretty simple. Hopefully we can get the lights working. And another good thing about staying here versus like the normal places we stay when we travel is that, you know, here is a hotel so you can get food there's a restaurant here and there's room service so that's nice um usually when we stay places that julia picked my partner it's like a hostel or somewhere you have to always it's like you're part of you're more immersive in the local experience but we're not local so i often like get really hangry i don't eat and stuff because sometimes we have trouble finding vegan options and yeah it's just easier there's a spa here there's room service is food so you can you you can feel comfortable when you're leaving your room knowing not knowing that you don't know where anything is it feels like a lot to like go into a new country and it's like all right i'm gonna live here for a week let me know where everything is and that's not very realistic so it's nice to just have like some comfort and some safety zone um yeah 
So yeah, I'm gonna go eat. Eating lunch, got it into our room. We got some rice, some peppers with onion, some corn that had cheese on it, had to take off. Um, some uh, plantains that's like kind of candied, kind of weird, and some frijoles negros. Yeah, I had to add some spicy, and it tastes pretty good. Wow, amazing how rice and beans and veggies just hit the spot every time. If you're not in it, are you? Is someone in there, like holding on or something? En camino a la playa. Maya está adelante. Espero que la encuentro sin problema. Hace muchísimo calor. Pero es más que no estoy acostumbrado con todo el tiempo en San Francisco. Soy una de esas personas frías. Pero el sol es bueno para el alma. El alma. El alma. No sé. Y me doy cuenta que la mayoría de la audiencia de Maya no va a entender esto. Pero quizás puede poner subtítulos. No sé. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. What day is it? I don't know what day is it. El Monday? Monday, el 14 de febrero de 2022. Translate? 
Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Day. More. <laughs> so, pretty much the the buffet stuff at the breakfast. The only thing that's vegan was the fruit. So, they told me just tell us what you want and we'll make it. Um, so I said, do you have tofu? And they said, yeah, but it has cheese. <laughs> what? Inside? I don't fucking know what they What's meant. Me? So I asked for like a scramble of like peppers and beans and mushrooms. And That's not what this is. Well, um, and I, I said that with like avocado and potatoes. And Turn off the TV. I guess they thought I said broccoli too. Um, so this is the how it came out <laughs> the combination it came out is I'm guessing the some peppers and mushrooms maybe in the beans. This is like beans. Then it's just <laughs> avocado, <laughs> potato and very broccoli. bland looking potato yeah. boiled potatoes and two brown. Uh, um, and then some fruit. That's okay. And then orange juice, guava juice, and that's some hot sauce for Maya. I don't like avocado. <laughs> yeah, so I'll I'll take care of the avocado because they gave us a ton of it. Buen provecho. So I'm doing my makeup to go out for Valentine's Day. I'm using this new palette that I bought here in Colombia by Beach Cosmetics. And this is what it looks like. It's so pretty. So I'm taking this sparkly shade and I'm just gonna pat it on my lid. I only brought one makeup brush, so we'll see what I can do with it. Take this darker pink, go into the cut the crease here. Ooh. And now I'm going to use some glitter, really make it pop on the inside. Pop the glitter. Yeah. Ooh. This is the finished makeup look. Very pink, very girly. Yeah. And I'll show you what my dress looks like. So I'm already now. This is my OOTN for the night, going out for dinner for Valentine's Day. I got, um, you saw my makeup, and I'm wearing some jewelry from Depop and um, Key New York Depop. And these bracelets are from Columbia. 
wearing this dress from Rap Boy and shoes from Camper. Feel very cute. Plaza de San Pedro, la Iglesia de San Pedro Claver, quien fue el amo, el defensor de los esclavos. La calle San Juan de Dios, donde ingresamos. Iglesia de San Pedro Claver. La calle Antonio Ricardo, por donde vamos. y el amo que lo compraba. Los esclavos lo compraban por su contextura física, dentadura, estatura. Mito, ¿qué cajero le sirve? It is the day after Valentine's Day the 15th and last time I saw you we were on the horse carriage tour of the city uh, which is was very fun I kind of did kind of feel bad for the horse but I wanted to support the people in my head if I if they have a better life maybe they'll treat the horse better and also um, the horse can feel my energy and know that not all humans are you know um, um, selfish or something but I guess I don't know if that really worked out but that was my intention but I definitely felt bad and um, but I learned a lot about the city that was good because the tour um, guide was telling us all about uh, the city and the history behind it and very fascinating um, and then we just went to dinner went um, dancing and just came home and yeah how was your day yesterday it's good the uh... The dinner was yummy. It was like this, I already forgot the name of it. It was like a big like mat, like plantain thing with like vegetables on top of it and avocado. It was, I'd never seen anything like it. Yeah, <laughs> but I it didn't have yummy. any of that, but um, it was good. Yeah, and just... Was it sweet? Yeah, it was sweet plantain, um, which isn't my favorite, but it's okay. I, yeah. I don't dislike it. Um, they do a lot of sweet plantain here. We got non-sweet plantain this time. <gasps> yes. Okay, so we just got our uh, lunch breakfast. This is our first meal of the day. We've just been lounging around. It's like 1 p.m. right now. And we're just going to eat. It looks really yummy. Rice and plantain. It looks like for papas and verduras y frijoles Lente. or lentils. Lentejas y una salada. Ensalada. Ensalada. See. Sí.